Okay, let's go. Mm, so a lot of people have been asking me to do a top 10 list. No, not really. Nobody asked me about this. So I said, how about I do something like that? Mm, and I thought the uh, most important top 10 list would be for me buttons that had the most impact. You know, from one, the worst, till 10, the very best, the GOAT. I'd say <clears throat> we should start with uh, something very easy. This is, this is almost as, as important as, uh, as the mouse itself. And because it's so important, I'll make this key very, very big. The tabulator key. With this uh, beautiful button, you can navigate through every menu. Um, I'd say next on the list is... Hmm, I'd say pretty important, but not so important. The button itself is pretty important. The problem is just uh, very little programs seem to work with it. So escape is rather on, on the 8, you know. Then you've got your enter key, never wrong. You're never wrong with the enter key. Could never wrong, go wrong with that. Most applications do know what the enter key is. That's never wrong. I'd say it's even... Nine. Uh, hmm. What I'd say is also quite important is um, yeah the space key, but not that important. I mean, just because it's a big bu button doesn't mean it's that important, you know. I'd say it's somewhere around the the five-ish area. Then we got. These, these three or four, they are somewhat important. I use them, the arrow keys, on a regular basis. But, mm -hmm, I'd say it's in the same area as the escape button since, um, can I also do, oh yeah, this is also working. Nice, didn't know that. And uh, what, what if you wrote bad, text or whatever and you needed to delete it backspace very important so the backspace goes more into mm -hmm, the 8 area and we should not forget about hmm, control yeah a lot of shortcuts without control not possible this is definitely in the 10 area key Option, okay, this is a Mac keyboard. I didn't realize that, <laughs> but this would be the Windows key. And Alt, they both are somewhat, somewhat important, I'd say. Shift, for doing caps lock stuff, shouting in the internet, on the internet, in the internet. The internet is a bunch of tubes, you know, very important to shout online. So this also goes the also, <laughs> that's the first entry for, uh, yeah, 7 out of 10. Then I'd say we go next to, hmm, what, yeah, here we have the caps lock button, not so important. Here and there you might maybe need it, but, but it's, it's rarely the case, I'd say. It's, it's more 4-ish. Four, four and the right shift key, you know, the left shift key, quite important, the right shift key. I mean, when you write with 10 finger system, blah, 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 yeah, sure. But if you don't, hmm, yeah, I'd say, hmm. I don't know, the right shift key always was sort of inferior to me. And then we have like the num block. This also has somewhat, somewhat it's worth, but, but not that highly. Problem is now. <laughs> I don't know where or how to do this. Wait, let, let let me split them up. Let's do this, and we do something like. Hmm, I'd say this is on the three area. Yeah. Okay. Next we have control function and this one is also six sort of but but not really you already have this stuff on the left side you never need it on the right side this is like nice to have 
And how often do you use it? I'd say even it's 2 out of 10. Then you have these. Uh, you need a little time to train yourself to use these end page, page up, page down. But when you use them, quite, quite handy. I'd say this is a 7 out of 10. Um, let's go to the lead key. I mean, just as important as the backspace key without deleting from left to right. Uh, but you use it a little less common from left to right, you know, or right to left, backspace. So the lead key, not that important because you already have the arrow keys also here. Then you have the home key. Uh, have I ever used a home key? Do I even have a home key? Oh, on this keyboard I don't even have a home key. Beautiful. Uh, fuck off all the way down. Then we have tilde. Tilda. This is like... Have I ever used this? Maybe once or twice, but rarely. Then we've got numbers. You know, numbers never wrong, but not that important. Mm -hmm. Maybe maybe on a four. You know, you need numbers on a regular basis. Then you have these fuckers. Maybe I should have picked out a fucking German keyboard. This would have been quite uh, smart. But no, I chose an American one. <laughs> Beautiful. So now I can't relate to 100%. But um, I'd say... Mm -hmm. Do I ever use those? I mean, the backslash, yeah, but the other ones? Not, not really. So backslash maybe, maybe. On a, on a three. But the other two, they go right down here. Then we've got like these ones, nah, not very important. Then you've got the F keys with the alternating function keys. I mean, yeah, nice to have, but also not that important. And at the end, we're sort of coming to, um, yeah, the, the keys themselves. They are, since technically speaking, you could also type with a mouse, I'd say this is, yeah, two to three. Well, let's put it in three. And here you can see my top ten categories, which are a little bit more now. Yeah. Bye.